Howdy folks! I'm driving the Accord! Oh my goodness! It, you know what? I checked. It's been about a year since I've driven the Accord. And of course, I forgot to bring my uh, phone holder. So I'm shooting this on my phone. Uh, and uh, yeah, so we improvise, we overcome, we adapt. I've got it now resting nicely on the handle of the passenger side door. And I'm going to try and drive as smoothly as possible without dropping it. So let's see, this is going to be a true test of, uh, of uh, my abilities. Well, just to show you how smooth the Accord is. Ah, oh, this car is so lovely! You know what? It's been sitting in limbo at Kenzo. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. Uh, hello. Uh, is this the right way up or the right way down or the right way up? Okay, there we go. So anyway, I'm driving the Accord, as you can see. And it's auto, so I can use my left hand for other things. Uh, not just the usual thing. Changing gears la! What did you think I meant? Come on! So everything's working. Uh, I'm very low on aircon gas. And uh, that's because the car has been sitting for about a year. And a little bit. Because uh, finally, finally, finally... I'm able to get the uh, road tax and uh, insurance done because this car is going to be Puspacom next week and it's going to be put in my name finally yeah so you know don't do what I did folks uh, which is to buy a car and re start restoring it without it being in your name uh, because if anything happens if like anything goes wrong and the car cannot be transferred you're screwed you have spent all that money and uh, you can't transfer the car. So that's 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 a horrible thing to happen now. You're going to be privy to my double chin because I'm going to put it here. And uh, does that work? No. The gear, the gear stick is in the way, isn't it? Okay, let's see if I can adapt this a little bit. How is that? Oh, oh, hey! There, you can see my face. That's my face. <laughs> anyway, as you can see, I'm perspiring a little bit because Aircon, ah. Ini tara gas punya lah. So yeah, I'm gonna go get that done. See, instinctively my hand goes here to change gear, but actually it's automatic. Hello, automatic. And uh, so I'm very, very, very happy to be driving the Accord again, the Accordion, the Accord again, and uh, heading to Kenzo to get my Aircon gas topped up. So I thought I'd just do a very quick video in car that uh, shows you the Accord is running so beautifully. And I am so happy to be driving this car again. You know, after getting, um, after the uh, 210 got sold, my big four-door luxury sedan, I guess this is going to take its place, Otto. Uh, this is going to take its place. Of course, I have the Waja, which is also a four-door sedan. Uh, but the Waja now has just proven itself so well in terms of long-distance drives that I, 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 I think uh, I'm going to resign the Waja to just long-distance drives. It's just so brilliant. And so frugal and good on gas and so is this Accord by the way. I don't know if you remember my very last video about a year ago. I just checked my playlist. Yeah, the Accord has its own playlist. That video was posted nine months ago and, and you know what? YouTube doesn't actually go down to the date of when it was posted. It was like posted about, about nine months ago. So that's how long I have not driven this car. Now, March 27th uh, is when the road tax uh, died uh, last year. And uh, I remember sending the car to Kenzo and Balagong before that. And uh, so yeah, it's been a year plus, maybe about a year since since I've driven it. Cannot be, cannot be. Because if the last video was nine months ago, so yeah, okay, let, let's just put it as almost a year, okay? But it's so nice to be driving this car and it's still so smooth. And it starts up, of course, Kenzo disconnected the battery. Uh, batteries in old school cars, one thing you have to remember is that um, Possibly, possible micro leaks, uh, micro current leaks will cause the battery to, to run out of uh, juice and uh, that's always a horrible thing to happen but um, everything's fine apart from the low aircon gas or rather now at this point no aircon gas uh, luckily the blower is still damn good it's like a tornado the blower is fantastic but uh, it's blowing um, how would I say it? Not even cool air, it's just blowing like uh, room temperature air, which means the aircon gas is completely gone. One way you can tell, uh, 
um, turn off the compressor. Uh, if your car has an AC switch, you can turn off the compressor and turn it back on again. The revs will drop slightly. You can feel it. And the uh, if it doesn't get cold, even after the revs drop, which means the, the compressor has kicked in, uh, you're low on gas. The good thing though is that the compressor is running and so it's not a compressor issue. You don't have to change the compressor or anything. Fingers crossed. Touch wood. This car got wood. No lah, this car got no wood. Okay, touch wood. It'll be okay. So anyway, I'm almost there. And uh, hopefully, hopefully it's just the gas. I think it's just the gas because I've, I've played with the compressor switch a few times already and yeah, it does, it does kick in and kick off and it's, uh, the compressor's running. So that'll be it. I'm gonna pause as usual and uh, just show you the car from the outside. Do a quick walk around, yeah? Give me a sec. Sarah so here at Kenzone in SS6 Klana Jaya and there's the Accord. How lovely. That low slung stance, double wishbones front and rear suspension which they don't do anymore. Not for this level of cars anyway. I mean they do it for upper high market performance cars and all. But ah oh, such a lovely car and I love my rays, my rims which match the car so well. Yes sir, you know what? I'm gonna take a screenshot. That's a nice thing about using this phone to shoot. I can pause, I can take screenshots. Only thing is a little bit of shake, sorry about that. But yeah, the old diamond eyes. And this engine, oh not a thing of beauty, but you know what? Still a damn good engine, I tell ya. Damn, damn good engine. Lovely, lovely. So anyway. Welcome back, my old diamond eyes. I'm very, very happy to see you. And uh, yeah, I think a long distance drive is in order for sure. What a lovely car. Still so nice to drive even after how many years? Excellent. Eh? So, anyway, thanks for watching. Take care, you all. Have a great day ahead. Peace. Bye.